Hey guys, it's Manny, and today I am going to talk about stress and how to deal with it. Um, because I have stress, and I get stressed a lot, and I have some ways that if any of you are like me and get super stressed, then maybe this will help you. Um, yeah, without further ado, let's get started and we will go. Uh, I get stressed out a lot. But it's not like I get stressed out in like tests or anything. Um, but I do get stressed in tests that like cause like a lot of my grade. I stress about the things like like homework that just I need to get done today and it's like uh not as bad. Cause I know some people can't they can't even like focus during a test, like if they're like so stressed out. That's I'm not like that. Oh, I'm gonna tell you um, what I do. There, I went on this boat and there was this amazing view and I took a picture of it because like, it, like all my stress went away when I got on that boat. So like, I was like, I need to like, you know, have this picture. So I have a picture like it. Um, I, t I didn't, I was really scared to take my phone on the boat and then like take a picture because I thought I was gonna drop my phone. So then I went on the side of the dock and I took a picture of it. And it's so actually a Polaroid picture. And every time when I get like super stressed, I was like, only a couple more weeks or days or something like that until you get to see this. And it's like really relieving, like, oh my God. And then seeing that picture just reminds me of all like the times I went in that boat. So um, I don't know, I think that if you have something, anything, can't doesn't have to be a picture or anything, or just something that you can look at or you can do that makes your stress like go a little bit down, then you should totally do it. And if you're super stressed and like you're trying to get everything done, and then just let yourself have a break and let yourself like just do something, like take a walk is usually, and then express outside express nature you know look at nature and everything if it's snowing outside then I don't think it's gonna make you more happy unless you love snow but um, it's really cold in the winter so I don't like walking in the winter <laughs> outside my house so but if it's like if it's like spring and it's like sunny or wherever temperature it's sunny where you live then you should go outside and like then you can get that sense of relief or something and and it studies have shown that it does improve your mood and it makes you more happier get your music playing but i mean if your music is like really like like hardcore and everything um but if that calms you down then play it if it doesn't then you should try like calm music like waterfalls or like rainforest like sounds I don't know um but you should just try some calm music if you need that done charts these charts are so useful oh get a to-do list you put all the to-do list things on there get another paper and then put actually like write down what you finished and then cross off what you finished uh on the other one and then that's gonna like reinsure like like oh my god okay so I just finished this and then and then you write something now they're like oh my god oh my god and then you're like I'm done so um I feel like that is more helpful than just crossing it off um for me I don't know about you so coloring you don't have to color um I have this adult coloring book that I color in sounds stupid but it's actually like really nice and like it's not like Dora the Explorer like coloring book it actually has like really nice designs and it's easy and so then you get creative and draw like what you want and like I don't know I'm just focused on like the art so I'm not really focused on like all the other stuff that I have um so um but if you hate art so much, 
I suggest you not do this because I mean, if I if somebody was telling me to draw something now like I and you hate drawing, then don't draw. <laughs> do things earlier. If you get things earlier done, then you're less stressed and you're less um less worked up and everything. So yeah, and it's such a relief to get things done earlier because you're like, oh now I don't have to do it then, so now I won't have as much work to get done on Thursday than on Tuesday. Um, so, yeah, take, like, deep breaths. If you feel yourself getting, like, your heart is, like, getting, it usually doesn't happen to me, but yeah, I know some people out there, like, their heartbeat increases when they get, like, stressed. So, even if you're not, if your heartbeat isn't beating, like, that fast, it's good to take deep breaths, um, to relieve, like, I don't know. Get that sense of relief or something. Really slow breaths is good. And lastly is, I think I've already said this, but um, give yourself a break. It doesn't really matter what you're doing, but like if you were just keep on working and working and working, that's not going to help you um, because then you'll realize how much more you have to get done. So I feel like if you just take a break and step back just for a little bit, um, that that will be good you'll feel much better and then you'll get back to work and then you'll feel better than you were before doing the work so then once you're done with the work you're like this is this is good and now you actually have a break so yeah so that's it for this video i hope it helped some of you guys that are like me or have it worse than me or you know just get stressed um and i hope you enjoyed it and give it a big thumbs up subscribe for me and comment and i'll see y'all with a brand new video that's ready bye